What is up guys, Matt from School Boys and Sand. Today we're doing a video. And this video is on the medal system and how it works. So it's very discreet and hidden. Uh, not like Battlefield 1 where you press when you press option you could track it or when you load into the game you could track medals. It's completely different, it's all changed. And the medals are like challenges now. So you've got to go to your profile and to awards and you've got your medals and your dog tags. Your dog tags are the same as they were before in Battlefield 1. Uh, for, so let's go on weapons for instance. What's this? There you go, you got to get 600 kills with a gear of 43. That's what you got to do. So your dog tags are pretty much the same thing. Now for the medals. So on Battlefield 1, DICE or EA developers, whoever runs the game or the server, gives you five medals a week. And they, these medals can be duplicated over and over again. It's like Neil. When he was on Battlefield 1, he completed 58 medals out of 60. And he waited months just to get one. And now it's all changed, which is, which is good. So you got your four categories. you got your strategic, your combat service, your teamwork and your war stories. Your war stories is campaign. So if you complete campaign, that's them done. So you don't need to bother about them. So your teamwork, your combat service and your strategic. So for strategic, you need to do your objectives. Offensive. Uh, Offensive kills, so that's aggressive kills uh, on Grand Operation. You got your defensive kills, which is on Grand Operation, so that's attacking and defend. And you got arm um, hundred objectives where you got plant the explosives on Grand Operation. And the, the even harder one, you've got to disarm hundred objectives, one hundred objectives. And then you've got for this one, you've got to build 2000 fortifications that's like sandbags, walls, foxholes, turrets. Um, for this one, you've got fortification assist, which is the same as that, that middle one. And then you've got this one construct 2000 fortifications, it's the exact same medal but on a lower side. For your combat services, you'd need your sniper kills. Uh, so you count the sniper in. What else? You've got to do two. Uh, sorry, you've got to get five hundred headshots at two hundred meters, which is pretty simple if you're doing long distance. I would recommend getting fairly well soon if you're going to do that on your snipers. That's with through the special uh, specialization. And there you go, get 250 kills at meals at range. Melee, sorry. 250 kills at melee range. So I believe that's point blank. Or that's throwing knives. Unless, unless it is, uh, if it's melee range, then I think you stab someone. And don't forget your 250 running headshots. That's pretty simple. All you have to do is just get a, like an LMG and just sit there and wait for someone to go past and go dang. That's easy, that one. And then you got melee 250 enemies, which is all right. Now you got destroy 250 vehicles, which is okay. Revive 250 mates. Resupply them a thousand times. Revive them. 250 times resupply 500 teammates as a medic so that's your bandage and your crates and then you got the hours which is basically fuck all there's no point discussing that and then you've got to get 500 kills with your side arms and 250 with your melee then you've got to get a thousand assists and fully suppress the 250 and a thousand spots and you got 250 revives. 
You got call in to. Uh, Sorry, you've got to call in 500 reinforcements, so you've got to be a squad leader to do that. And then you've got to issue the orders, and you can get spawned on. Or So that's basically your captain medal. That's your captain medal, that one. So you need your attack if, you need defensive kills. You need to capture 250 objectives, disarm them, and arm them. So pretty much all the medals are currently count on each other so this is exactly the same but set out differently that's pretty simple if you do is just play the game right you got complete 500 squad armor uh, squad orders so you've got to either be squad leader and go somewhere or you follow your teammates suppressed is easy you just got to shoot near him let someone else kill him and you got to resupply a thousand teammates i don't know why i'm and reinforce 250 capture points with a towable vehicle. So I'm assuming you get a, a turret and you wheel it into your base and you just sit there and get points. So that's it for the medal system, that's how it all works. It's basically like a challenge. So you pretty not pretty much um you're not receiving them, but you can achieve them if you want to, depending on how long you play the game or not. So uh, stay tuned for more videos like that, and I'll see you all soon. Adios. Check out our live streams, our Red Dead, and yeah, I'll see you all soon. Adios.